I'm Emma, and this is the Cougar Campus News. Planning to go to prom? Not planning to go to prom? Either way, you need to clear your detentions by April 4th. If you have any outstanding detentions, you will not be able to attend prom. What if you're not planning to go to prom? Well, then there is a special prize just for you. If you do not clear your detentions by April 4th, then you will lose your off-campus lunch privileges. Yep, it's true. So be the role model. Serve your detentions. The Community College Application Workshop is today. CSM, Kenyatta, and Skyline will be here to help with their application. Now here's Ms. Jolivet with a special announcement about some upcoming activities. Hi Cougars! Just to let you know, don't forget, tomorrow for the seniors, tomorrow is the Community College Application Workshop in the library from 8 to 12. See you there. And also next week is Wellness Week. Make sure you watch announcements to see what's being offered during lunch. Thank you. Bye. The Blanket Improv Scholarship Auditions are on Saturday, March 14th at 10 a.m. in the library. If you signed up for local scholarship and are interested in being a candidate for the Blue Blanket Improv Scholarship, come to the auditions for a chance to win some money. Hey Cougars, did you see the donuts outside this morning? Here's Deputy Chase. Deputies, what we do is go around to the local schools. We did it at Cooney a couple weeks ago. Redwood City, we do it at all our different schools. Just to come out into the community and to say hello, be friendly, um, answer any questions they may have. Just a relation thing, so we can all get along and they can meet us and we can meet them. And a little bit more of a casual atmosphere, right? Definitely. It's here to have fun. You know, give away some cocoa, get them some donuts, and you know, get them all sugared up so they can have a good start to their day. Hey, Preston. How are those donuts? Yummy. Cool. Female seniors, interested in joining sororities and Greek life in college? Please come see your counselor for an opportunity to win the San Mateo Panhellenic Award. The application is due to Miss Lamelli March 15th. Please come speak with Miss Lamelli if you have any questions. Hey Cougars, what would you do with $300? This is a reminder that the deadline to enter the City of Half Moon Bay's Census Essay Contest is coming up soon. There are cash prizes available and first place is $300. And as of now, no one from our school has entered the contest. So you can win money for sure if you enter and write an essay. The registration deadline has been extended to March 18th. Essays can be submitted in English or Spanish. For more information, contact Miriam Salazar at the City of Half Moon Bay at the email address you see now on the screen. Feeling hungry? Getting ready for lunch coming up soon at the end of fourth period. Today on the menu, beef burritos. Now here's Haley with sports. Congratulations to the track team for an outstanding performance at the Rust Buster Invitational at Monta Vista High School in Cupertino this Saturday. For the girls, senior Claire Yerby won the 800 meter and the process broke the HMV high school record. It was the fastest time in CCS this season and the second fastest time in California so far this year. Senior Kendall Metsukani won the 400 meter. Senior Raven Fortin medaled in both the 100 hurdles and the 300 hurdles. Great job. Sophomore Michaela Sandino medaled in both hurdles as well in the frost off division. Freshman Stephanie Spencer medaled in both the shot put and discus throw in the frost off division. Natalie Cathroy medaled in the frost off 600 meter run. On the boys side, freshman Moss Mitchelson won medals in the 1600 meter run and the 3200 meter run. Julia Rodriguez cleared 4-8 and high jump to set a new personal best in a new event for him. This week, HMB competes at the K-Bell Invitational at Westmore High School. The varsity baseball team tied Menlo 4-4. Lucas Meehan started on a mound going three innings with three strikeouts. HMB scored one in the second to take the lead after Casildo Guerrero walked and later scored on a William Moffitt sack fly. In the sixth, the Cougars would add three more runs as Jared Medham doubled the score on an error. Moffitt knocked in Kate Duncan and Guerrero with a two RBI single. Unfortunately, HMB let the lead slip 
away. Menlo would tie in the bottom of the six, and then the game was stopped due to darkness. Liam Harrington threw a gem on Tuesday for the Cougar JV, allowing zero runs and besting San Mateo by a score of seven to nothing. Harrington earned the win for Hafen Bay, scattering six hits over seven innings, strikeouts four, striking out four. The JV secured the victory thanks to five runs in the first inning. The big inning was thanks to the single by Ryan Harrington and Drew Doran. Half Moon Bay Cougars JV racked up 11 hits in the game. Doran Harrington and PJ Modena all managed multiple hits.